What's up, misfits, and welcome back to the channel. Maverick here, and ready to help you take down the borough of Islington and Hackney for Watch Dogs Legion. We've got another three tasks to knock out, so let's just jump into it. Head over to the Old Canal Warehouse for some good old-fashioned sabotage. After scoping out the place a bit, you're going to realize that Albion's a little more protective of this outpost than their usual place. We've got turrets, we've got drones, and we've got tough guys. If you've unlocked some of the tech upgrades to hack these, feel free to just get involved, especially with the turret. Towards the northwest end of the compound, you're going to see a circuit panel interact with to right next to a gate. I set it up for a quick escape in case I need it. Your main target is about halfway up the construction site. I climbed to the top of the site to hit up an ETO skimmer, and then I just rode a construction drone down to the, uh, the target site because, because you know I could. Sabotage the equipment, and you've knocked out your first task. Oh, by the way, you're going to find some tech points at the very top of the site. Just ride the drone around a bit and you'll you'll see it. Next up, we're taking down a VIP at the Stafford Auto Garage. Your target is located on the second level in the outdoor parking section. You're going to have one circuit panel to interact with and you've got one key to download. This is one of those times that the unlimited download range passive skill comes in handy. After sneaking my way to the second level, I thought I'd be kind of cheeky and uh, get a kill, but uh, I pretty much failed. Those cars are locked into place somehow, so I had to turn up the ringer on his phone and just went straight fisticuffs. Clear out, and it's on to the next mission. Last up is an evidence collection mission that was pretty frustrating for me at first. I'm not sure if this is the quote-unquote book way to complete it, but it was better than running around looking for any greats and it's just easier this way. So head over to the Evergreen City Garden and use the CCTV camera to call in a construction drone. You're going to want to equip your spider bot, which if you don't have, you should be able to afford from the earlier tech points. Drop the construction drone to the ground, pull up your spider bot, hop it right on top, and then just fly your construction drone over to the gap where the rafter and the roof are. Take over the spider bot and jump on through. Once in, you're going to interact with the terminal, pick up the evidence, and you're all set. Now it's off to meet your contact and complete the final mission for the subrising. You'll find your contact at the World of Tomorrow. I'm not trying to brag or anything, but mine was pretty much the raddest so, looking old lady I've ever met. Been trying to reach that sec. Oh. You'll be using a modified drone to disable some Albion raid vehicles. Head to the roof to start the chase. Your altitude is going to be restricted with the drone, so you're actually going to have to navigate around and be careful in what you bump into. But don't worry about fighting the other drones or the people at the locations. I just flew to each site, lobbed a couple of shock bombs, and I moved on to the next. You're going to have to be quick about it because it's time restricted, but it really wasn't too hard to knock out, and I did it on my first try. Once done, you'll unlock all the tech point locations for the Islington and Hackney Borough, as well as the football hooligan skilled operative. Oh, there you have it, guys. There's our uprising guide for the Islington and Hackney Borough. If this was your first time stopping by the channel and you enjoy gaming strategy content, feel free to subscribe to all my other misfits out there. Take care.